Welcome to Pattern Making Class. This is Annette Julie, and today we're going to learn how to make a jacket block draft from a torso block. So block really means we just have it in manila paper and that we've perfected it. A draft is working on the soft paper and it's a working pattern, it's in progress. Once you've perfected it, uh, your jacket block draft, you can put it on hard paper. So please go ahead and watch my videos on how to make a torso. Also, how to transfer from soft to hard paper. And then you'll be ready to go forward with what we're working on today. So, here you see the back torso and you see the front torso. And I've lined them up with the side seams together and I've also lined them up with the matching hem lines and a little space in the front and the back for our grain lines. So I'm going to start by making a goal post. I'm going to go ahead and use right there for our center front, right down here for our hem and over here for my center back giving myself ample space to work with and we'll draw our grain line and goal post This is a marking paper, a type of pattern making paper. You can buy it on the roll. You can also buy it by the yard. This is going to end up being our center front. Now let's go ahead and do our shared hem. Finish up that little corner. Here we go. Now we're working on our hem. And now we're going to draw our center back. This is our hem. If you don't have a marking paper with a grid, Please use an L square to make your right angles. And this is going to be our center back. And there's our goal posts. Back's going to go here. Front's going to go here. So I think I'll start with the front. Going to line this up here at the hem. Lining it up here at center front. Let's go ahead and trace this off. Sometimes I like to use a ruler to help me trace the line so I get some nice sharp lines if I've used this block a whole many a whole bunch of times. Let's trace off that notch. We just traced neckline, shoulder, armhole, armhole notch. Let's continue on. Our 
our side seam, side seam dart, Let's make sure we've traced the whole outer portion. That looks good. Now we're gonna move into tracing the inner portion, all of our darts, and we can transfer them. So my dart tips already have holes in them that I've punched through with my awl and my apex. So I should be able to mark with my pen through to some dart tips to transfer. Okay, great. Let's check and make sure. pretty good. Let's see if we can see those markings. Now let's go ahead and connect the darts. This is our side bus dart. Our apex. And now we have our torso darts. And now we have our torso darts and our side bust dart. You can put another grain line. The goal post is a grain line, but you can place another one, one or two inches from the center front. This is going to become our our jacket. So this is going to be our front jacket block draft. And I happen to be working with the size 8. Always we can add our name and then we can put uh, roughly the date or that exact date. So this is turning into the jacket right now, even though I've traced off the torso. Now we're ready to trace off the back. We're going to go ahead and place that down, matching our hem and matching our center back. I'm going to stop here and we're going to continue on in our next video.